you see my my shoe chair i've had this shoe chair for a long time but it didn't look like this before it looked like this And then I changed it to this. So I pretty much didn't take off the fabric. I, what I did was I added my own fabric to the top of the old fabric, which was the cheetah. And I wanted something that was bright, that went well with the chair, because you can see the chair has the deep fuchsia pink color. And this was the perfect fabric to go along with it. So I pretty much um, took transparent paper because I don't think I did a video on this. So I took transparent paper to get my um, my pattern. Anybody who sews know that you have to have a pattern for anything. So in order to create your own pattern, you can use transparent paper, pretty much line it up to this using tape, and then you trace it with a pencil around the sections that you want the fabric to be. So I traced around this section and I pretty much cut it out, cut the fabric out, pin, pin my pretty much what I did was I pinned my uh, pattern to the fabric then I cut the fabric fabric out and then what I did was I um, pretty much glued it on fabric glue you use fabric glue and you glue it on And with the back part, I didn't have to create a um, pattern. What I did was just went around it with the fabric and I glued it and then I used this handy tool here. This, this comes in handy. I use this to staple the fabric on to make sure that it didn't come off. So get you one of these staple guns. And now... 